Right, hello, welcome back to another Max on Tour video today. We are back with a derby. The last video was Swindon versus Scunthorpe um, a few days ago, so if you, ha if you haven't already checked out that video, feel free to do that. But today, Scunthorpe versus Grimsby. It's a kind of underrated derby, I think, a little bit. Um, I don't know too much about it. I mean, the Scunthorpe end today in the terracing, so it should be a decent atmosphere. I've seen videos from when Scunthorpe won at Grimsby early on in the season. It was mad, absolute scenes. Scunthorpe won that. I think they've won the last three um, fixtures, so Grimsby, they're going to want revenge today. Hopefully, I'm not a you know, bad omen for Scunthorpe. I want them to win. Um, I know Grimsby have unbelievable fans. Um, Scunthorpe, I'm not too sure, but we'll, 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 we'll see today. We'll see. When I went to go and see Scunthorpe a few days ago, I thought they were pretty average. Um, I know both sides are pretty much mid table in League Two. They're nothing special, let's be honest. Um, but, you know, Derby Day, you know, the, you know the old cliche, you know, form, but goes out the window and all that sort of stuff. Um, go with Simon. Um, so it should be a decent day. 65 out of the 92 now, so we're really, really making progress. Um, I'm really excited today. It's a derby day. Like I said last week, we don't do enough derbies on the channel. Um, we're going to Rangers next week and then going to Leverkusen in the week after. So do subscribe if you haven't already. Close to 10k, so it would be brilliant if we could get there very, very soon. But without further ado, I'm going to stop rambling on. Up to Scunthorpe. It's an early kickoff, one o'clock. Up the Scunny. I don't know. Let me know if I'm saying that right. But yeah, up the Scunthorpe. Come on, boys. Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? It's gonna be a tasty one. Simon, hello. hello. You've got your villa scarf on. I have. But today, for once only, it's a scunthorpe scarf. It is. Because they're playing Claret and Blue. Same sort of colour. So exactly, you can't no complain. Claret and Blue Army. Yep, come on. Top man. You know what time is. You know what time is. Oh. Is that time? Is it comfortable? This suit you man with a claret blue scarf. Perfect colour. Claret blue armour. On your way out. <laughs> Top man, thank you. Cheers, mate. Whoa, whoa. Hello, Simon. How are the uh, the, the burgers at Scunthorpe United? It's alright. Quite big, actually. Quite big? Struggling to finish it. Struggling yeah. to finish it? Yeah. It's alright, not too bad. We'll take that. £4.70. £4.70, you don't mind. The ground is not bad at all. Proper terracing. You can't go wrong. Proper football stadium. I like this. Very nice. So we're back row, boys. We're back row. Away end is all across there. They'll be lively today. This terracing, though, decent. Aaron, hello, hello. the cricket connoisseur. If you like cricket, follow this geezer. What are you thinking today, son? Right, I think it's going to be quite close to Derby. Factor yeah. in, good atmosphere. I'm going to know two on scum for. Go two on scum for. Mate. I'd love it if I could get the win tonight. Um, carnage. Absolutely carnage. Carnage, yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm gonna have to agree. I'm gonna go 2 1 Scun 4. Um, Grinsby to score first, but Scun to score late. I just want absolute scenes here today. It's terrorism as well. I know Grimsby fans are very good, but we shall see. Simon, score predictions. Uh, I reckon quite a scrappy game. Dar Darby's always are, aren't they? Yeah. So. Close game, I reckon we should to shade 1-0. 1-0? Yeah, I think it's going to be tight. We've all said there's going to be one goal in it. I just want goals. If this is 0-0, then I'm not going to be happy. Uh, but that's fine. All we want is goals. Terracing is nice. Stadium is nice. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hey. <laughs> Fans are good. Feds are in force. Good fans. Yeah! Hey! Hey! Get your cards out, son. Get them out. Oh, oh, oh. Scraps and fights, you love to see it. Proper derby. Get into them. Yes. Please. Oh, 
Oh, brilliant. Sums this game up. Brilliant. Oh. oh. Shock, lads. Nil, nil. <laughs> The ball has gone out the stadium more times than we've had a shot. Um, it's been it's been dreadful. <laughs> um, it's just hoof, hoof every single time you get the ball, throw in here, throw in there, hoof the ball. It's not good, man. Aaron, you you enjoying your day? <laughs> well. Maybe not the action on the pitch. The atmosphere's been decent. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the atmosphere's yeah, yeah, yeah. been okay. It's been okay. Grimsby fans are good. Scunthorpe fans are okay. Definitely on the most of there. Yeah, we need a goal. Yeah. Well, something, even a shot on target. Yeah, can we just have a, a shot? Free kick. <laughs> yeah, a free kick. I mean, a corner would be nice. Like, it's just, it's really poor. Um, especially Scunthorpe. Grimsby have tried to play football, um, but uh, Scunthorpe just boot the ball, boot the ball every single time. It's League Two for you, unfortunately, but. Come on, you iron! A good ball in it. It's a bit easy. It's a bit easy. It's poor defending, but one nil Grimsby. Absolute scenes down there. Oh my God. Half an hour to go, 2 0. Game over, surely. Shocking defender. Shocking, shocking. What is going on here now? Yeah, I believe managers are scrappy, players are scrappy. If he doesn't dish out a red card, are we disappointed? Oh dear. Oh dear. Grimsby fans are loving it. <laughs> oh wow, okay. Right then, yeah, that was uh, Scunthorpe Grimsby. Decent little derby. I think it is a little bit underrated, um, you know, in the whole national scheme of things. I think it is a tiny little bit underrated as a derby, but I think Grimsby fans are absolutely fantastic. I think we're going to Grimsby when they play Plymouth on the 28th of March, and I know Plymouth have really good fans, and so do Grimsby, so that would be a good one. But yeah, credit to Grimsby fans. There was a lot of them there. They made a lot of noise. Fair play to them. Scunthorpe, a few empty seats was I was a little bit disappointed about, but their, their fans were okay in the terracing bit, but they were not nothing special I'm afraid. Um, I think Grimsby fans are you know a lot better to be fair to them. Um, no offence to Scunthorpe, like I thought they're you know decent club, decent ground, um, but just you know the fans are not quite on the same level as Grimsby but still not too bad. The game as a whole like I said at half time was scrappy, scrappy to say the least. I think Grimsby tried to play football a little bit more but Scunthorpe, every time they got the ball, they just seemed to like just, just hoof it and hope for the best. It was it was one of them where they got the ball panicked and just booted it, whereas you know Grimsby tried to play football, like I said, and that was quite infuriating to watch. It was it was a difficult watch, um, especially when they went 1-0 down and you just think there was no chance of them getting back in the game. The first goal was an easy header, unmarked. Um, the second goal again from a corner, unmarked. So it was a little bit poor from a Scunthorpe point of view, but fair play to Grimsby. They probably deserved it just 
um, you know, in the grand scheme of things. But, you know, fair play. They've got the three points and, you know, they've got the bragging rights now. But, yeah, shout out to everyone that said hello as well at Scunthorpe. Massive shout out to you lot. If you haven't enjoyed the video, please do leave a like. Share it around as well. If you're a Grimsley fan, Scunthorpe fan, share the video around. It really does help me out. Leave a like on the video. Comment where else we should be going. Where are we going next? I don't know. Where are we going? I don't know. I don't think we've got too much lined up. Oh, yeah, Rangers, Leverkusen, Grimsby versus Plymouth. So, you know, there's a lot lined up. So, do subscribe to the channel. Very close to 9,000, 10,000 subs. So, if you'd help me get there, that would mean a lot. Without further ado, I'm going to stop waffling. Thank you very much for watching. See you next time.